Hey gang, it's Ark. Welcome back to our No Fires Savage Hunter dual challenge run. Um, in the last episode, I was, um, I think it's fair to say, a little bit reckless. And um, we got mauled twice by a bear. Um, I did manage to uh, sleep and fully heal after the first one. But now we're kind of stuck in an awkward... It's like midday... And my condition is really low. So I think what I'm going to do is I am going to risk it. Um, I am going to go outside and continue doing things. Um, this is with the with the understanding. Um, if a bear detects me, then it's quite likely that this uh, um, that I'll lose this challenge. Um, Bears are fairly easy to stay away from under normal circumstances, so I'm hoping that that's not going to be a problem. Um, and if a wolf gets onto me, um, I'll probably shoot it from a fair ways away with the revolver. Let me just make sure that I have both of my weapons on me. Yeah, seem to be fine there. So uh, put those away. All right, let's step outside and see what condition we're in. I think I need more old man's beard. I ended up having to use quite a bit of it. I'll just grab what's here and we'll take stock later. Managed to lose enough of my clothing that I'm actually getting a little bit cold out here. That was the other thing, as I really should have at least repaired my clothing up to full before going after the bear again. Now, I am going to walk down to sort of the area where he is, but I'm going to stay as far over towards this side. Actually, maybe the thing to do is go out, down on, out onto the ice. Let's do that. So we'll come down here. I don't remember if I checked that isn't a very good way to get down. Okay, we've got deer and wolf, or just deer. I guess that's just three deer out there. Alright, I'm fairly confident that I... Did not check this fishing hut. It looks like there's actually two here that I could um, deploy. Oh, the other thing to keep in mind is I actually did um, shoot the bear um, near the end of the previous episode. So there's actually a chance that he'll just die. Um, I think technically he's supposed to always be killed by that eventually because of the bleed out. Um, but I think there, I think sometimes it doesn't work the way it should. So I'm not really putting too much stock in that. Well, look at that. Finally have a knife. Um. Do I want to pick that up? Oh, lucky day. I guess I'll take it and decide later. I'm just thinking what use do I really have for it? The hatchet is better for if I get into a wolf struggle. Um, I don't really need to harvest animals. Don't think I need to do any crafting that I need the knife for. I guess I could use it to slightly more quickly harvest cloth. That's about all I can think of. Oh, I've already been here. Okay. 
Um, oh, I must have come out here from the road then. Okay, I believe that those houses are the ones across from the Quonset. I do want to head back there. But as long as we're out on the ice, let's go get uh, this last fishing hut. I think that's the last one. And then we will have completely... To the best of my knowledge, looted everything in this entire lower coastal side of things. Um, except for those two huts that I left back at the fishing village. Uh, but I've also got some other stuff back there that I wanted to go back for. I think there's some food and water, and I think there's another pair of insulated boots there as well. I think the bear cave is around here somewhere, and I don't see the bear. It's definitely possible, or even likely, that he bled out somewhere. Alright, we don't need this pry bar. I'll take it. Now that is actually a nice item. Revolver cartridges. Okay, while I'm in here and it's warm, let me check out my journal. Um, bears killed one. Okay, so I actually did successfully kill that bear. Um, the only reason I looked it up there is just because I need to keep track of it for the challenge. Um, it doesn't really matter whether I killed it or not, since I'm never coming back to this area. Um, but just for the purposes of the challenge. Funnily enough, that may actually be the first time that I've ever killed a bear in this game. Kind of tempted to try to find him. But it doesn't look like he's in this bear cave. Yeah, I mean, could be anywhere. In a pretty large area around here. Alright, let's head back. Um, that area there is where all the houses are. The Quonset should be just across from there. We can get all of our clothing worked out. All right, one bear down, four to go. Um, we have a lot of wolves left to kill. I'm not going to go seek them out until my condition is higher, though. this is the right location. I'm actually questioning now. Yeah, there's houses across the street, it looks like, so I'm pretty sure this is where the concept is. I don't actually know this map that well, but only because I haven't played it in a couple of years. Okay, we've got it. Ooh, multiple wolves are aware of me. Let's get the revolver out. Now this is where, if I'm not careful, I could end this run. 
Okay, that's it, right? Just those two? I'm gonna attempt this from pretty far away, just to make sure I don't let him aggro on me. Aim just a little bit higher. Okay, I think I missed, but obviously the sound scared him off. So, they are just over that hill up there. Oh my goodness. Alright, let's go with the hatchet. Okay, I did get him off of me. Get my gun back out. I got a laceration. All right, you know what? Uh, let's just get inside before they detect me again. Wow, I thought I lost it there. Um, I don't know why he charged me. Uh, but considering how tired we are, we're just gonna spend the night in here tonight. So we'll take no further risks. Gotta check my situation here. I don't have anything that needs to be healed. So I got lucky there. See, is there any clothing I left lying around in here? Doesn't look like it. All right, I have a lot of time left in the day, so we're just gonna stand around. We're going to um, drink some more water. Don't think I need that underwear. Yeah, I just have a lot of repairs to do. Alright, so let's wear this on the inside. This on the outside. I need to find a place to rest. This can be repaired with cloth, so no danger there. I'm missing gloves and boots completely. Because of that bear attack. Alright, let's drink some more sodas. Probably gonna use the herbal tea tonight, um, just to make sure I recover a ton of condition, since I am very low now. And I can always break down these curtains for more cloth. But let's go ahead and get started on clothing repairs. So, um, it's my, okay, this is in really bad shape. Definitely wanna repair that before it disintegrates. And actually, since that's such a nice item, let's go ahead and repair it to full. Um, what happened? Did it get too dark? Did I fail? Not too dark. Maybe I just failed the repair. I didn't see it say failed, but... Um, I don't know why that's ruined, but I'm going to get rid of it. Alright, let's just try this again. I'm not sure what happened there. Okay, so those are back to new condition. Um, I've got more toques lying around in places. I think this is the thing that I want to make sure I get repaired only 30 minutes at a time. So let's just do that again. I'm so tired. I could lay down right here. Yeah, I'm fully tired now. Um, don't really want to lose a ton of condition to just go ahead and break down a couple of these. I should recover all my condition just because I'm using the herbal tea. I'm gonna have plenty of this to use in the morning to finish repairing my clothing. Alright, it's nice and dark now. 
Let me figure out what I'm eating. I want only things that are very unlikely to give me food poisoning, because I really don't want food poisoning. Well, it looks like I might be out of luck. Go ahead and eat these peaches. And my calories are pretty much full. Let's drink the herbal tea for the bonus. And then I'll top off my water. And like magic, we should be at full condition in the morning. Okay, we survived. We didn't lose our climbing socks. Congratulations all around. Let's, um... Yeah, that was ruined. I'm still gonna need quite a bit more cloth. Oh, no wonder they were after me. I completely forgot I was carrying this around. Alright, well that was dumb. I can't really afford to eat this right now. I'm just gonna drop it. I have... More food than I'll ever need. I can always go grab cattails if I start to run out of food. But I shouldn't have been carrying that. Of course the wolves were going to come after me. Alright. I believe I have more than enough cloth now. Yeah, we're already up to ten. I only need to do a few more repairs. Anything in danger of being destroyed? This is... That's not in much danger. Um, I can afford to spend a little bit of time on this. Okay, that's at 100%. Um, you know what? I might as well. Alright, those are in good shape, that's in good shape, I need boots and gloves still, everything else is fine, some of this stuff I can repair in a bit, this is not in the outside slot so I'm not worried about it. Alright, let's get out there and get back to the Quonset, I think that's where I left a bunch of clothing behind. Okay, it's really foggy, have this out in case we run into anybody. Uh, I feel like I'm slightly lost. What was that? Alright, visibility is really poor. This is the main road. The Quonset should be over there. Definitely heard something, but... Oh. Alright, well, I guess we killed him with a shot. Oh, no, I killed him in the struggle with the, um... Hatchet. Because I caused him to bleed. Alright, I actually need to make a note of that. First, let me figure out where this guy's coming from me for. Missed. I think I scared all of them off, though. Let's go ahead and go inside. I don't actually need any of those. That's dirty water that I'm not going to need this run, probably.
Not gonna need any of that stuff. I'm gonna examine both of those. Ski gloves are better than nothing. I don't think I need any of this stuff. Bedroll's in the container. Gotta remember that for when I finally leave. And I'm probably not gonna look in here again, so let me take that. Go to my inventory. Drop that on the ground, and then we can move it up here. Put it in the corner so it's not obstructing everything. All right, and what was in this? Just a bunch of stuff I'll never need. Okay. Um, I might end up taking that with me once I finish the other one. So I think what I'll do from now on is when I want to kill a bear, I'll wait until evening. And then I'll go out, and that way if I get into a struggle, I can just go home and sleep. Um, and not have to wander around with really low condition. Um, I have so much extra water. And there's a bunch of extra food in here too. Like I have a bunch of high condition food stashed away. Transfer three liters of that in here. Um, yeah, and all this low condition food that I'm currently carrying, that's stuff that I'll eat when I'm hungry at night and I don't need to recover a lot of condition. Which hopefully will be tonight. If I don't do something really stupid and uh, lose a bunch of condition now. Alright, let me sit in this car for a second. It just occurred to me that I never actually put this stuff on. But where are the gloves? Um, let's see. Boots provide... Work boots provide 7% protection. Trail boots provide 5%. So we're going to wear the work boots. And these trail boots I'm going to harvest. And let's repair these. Killing a ton of time on just repairing items. Okay, so those are up to 83%. That's in good shape. I think this is the only thing left to repair. Yeah, it's not telling me failed. Um, I guess I just have to infer that. I thought it used to tell you. Or maybe I'm just blind. And it is, but I'm just not seeing it. Okay. Those are in good enough condition that we probably won't lose them. Of course, now visibility is awful again. Or my hearing. Just crows. Alright, I kind of want to try to be a little bit productive here. Where are you? I can never tell from the sound how close they are. I think I either scared him or hit him, I'm not sure which. Alright, well let's get this reloaded. I didn't get a skill point, so... I guess I somehow missed from that close. Alright, I want to head up this path. I believe there's another house up here. Okay, I definitely hit him. So he should die.
I wonder if they recently changed the wolf behavior. Because it was my understanding um, that they tend not to charge you um, unless you actually aim your weapon at them. I mean, that's how they've always behaved in the past. Um, I'll be pretty happy if that's been changed because I don't really like the uh, psychic wolves. Alright, so there is a house up here. It is not burned down. Let's go ahead and step inside here. And while I'm thinking about it, let's go to our journal, take some notes. Um... Wolves killed in melee, because we got that one with the um, hatchet. So we're one-fifth of the way done with that, one-fifth of the way done with the bear part of the challenge. need that herbal tea. I'll take it. It's so strange because if this were interloper, I'd be really happy to find that. But it is completely useless to me now. I think I can use this. Wow, a lot of these are in really poor condition. for this. Okay, I think this is a good stopping point. Um, in the next episode, we'll go upstairs, we'll loot the rest of this house, and then we may progress further up the hill. Um, I think there's some trailers further up, uh, but then as we get closer to evening, which it's already getting fairly close to evening, um, I think there's a bear that patrols around here too. So if we run into that, we might try to take him out. Uh, new episodes will be coming out every day. And thanks for watching.